Hello, I'm Dominic. I'm Nathan. And I'm Nick. And we are Team Hackettini with our project, Cognitive Cardio. For our project, we wanted to tackle an issue that is common and has a substantial impact on people's lives. After researching various diseases, we were surprised by the number of people who are diagnosed with dementia. At 10 million diagnoses in the world a year, most people have been affected by the disease in one way or another. There is currently no cure for dementia. However, there are tested and approved treatments that are able to slow some of the symptoms. The Alzheimer's Association states that research reported at the 2019 Alzheimer's Association International Conference suggests that adopting multiple healthy lifestyle choices, including healthy diet, not smoking, regular exercises, and cognitive stimulation may decrease the risk of cognitive decline in dementia. We chose to create a product that addresses the latter two treatments. We created a web application that leads the user in a set of exercises and challenges that act as a workout for both the brain and the body. We wanted to ensure that the user would have fun in this challenge, and we built this application in that, with that in mind. The program introduces new exercises for the user to perform until they are unable to remember the sequence of actions that led them there. Think of it like a combination of Just Dance and the memory game Simon. A core feature of this application is also adaptability. It can be used to suit a user's goals. For example, a user can decide whether or not to use exercise weights while doing their actions. Thus, the application can be used for both stretches and strength exercises. We created the web application front end by using a combination of HTML and JavaScript. The back end motion tracking was performed using the CV2 library in Python, specifically the pre trained body AI model. This program tracks the user's arms in relation to the rest of their body frame to determine what action the user is trying to perform. As this demonstration shows, the user will be provided with the order of inputs with the direction they are supposed to reach out for or punch. They are given visual feedback when they are reached out far enough in the correct direction. They will then repeat the sequence with one new step added until the user makes a mistake. At this point, a message will appear informing the user of this score, and they will be given an opportunity to restart the game. And here's an example of the stretching approach as opposed to the previous exercise approach. We are proud of this project as it provides a service that is accessible to anyone, at any time, at no cost. It helps users stay healthy, and it's actually pretty fun. We hope this will encourage users to regularly use the program. In the future, we would enjoy expanding the website to include a variety of other fun, interactive, and creative games that offer a digital alternative for treatments to patients with neurological diseases. Our project is just one of the many applications of computer vision. We believe it has great potential to improve users' lives through its applications in healthcare, and we are excited to see how this technology develops. Thank, Thank you. you.